What up guys, Double B here. Been off of, uh, we're actually live streaming this, so it's gonna be a little bit different for my YouTube followers, cause typically I just uh, record the video as it is and then post. Um, but yeah, this time we're gonna go right back into our career mode. This is the, the 250F, it's the stock 250. Um, we're going into round number two. We are tied in first with Jeffrey Hurlings. So yeah, this, this is pretty cool. I uh uh with like battlefield and stuff. Um but yeah, so we're we're live streaming and then I'm just going to pull this video from uh from the from the Twitch and then just throw it on the channel. Uh for, so for those of you who are watching on YouTube, you can just skim ahead and you can bypass this loading screen or, or watch. I mean, that's cool too. You want to increase my watch time. That's all good. Um, but yeah, so hopefully we'll see how this goes. This is the first time that we're, we've continued uh, the, the career mode in this fashion. So we'll see how it goes. So this is round number two. We are in rainy, wet, sloppy conditions, as you can see. I'm still new to the game. I haven't played too much since posting round one. Uh, I've messed around with the two strokes a little bit. Again, there's no no qualifying, no practice. So by default, we're in the outside gate on this stacked 250 class. We are the privateer. The only privateer, it seems. We're gonna give him a head start, like always. All right, the boys are gone, and we're going to go. I have not touched this track. Brand new, brand new. So we'll see how it goes. Kind of got to learn the track as I go. It makes it a little bit more of a challenge. We're a little bit inside there. We're good. Look at the ruts already starting to form. This rainwater, everything's slippery. What a sloppy mess. It's like we're riding, it almost looks like we're riding on grass, don't it? Now I do have something exciting when we do start the, uh, the two stroke videos. Uh, I have a modded Husqvarna 125 that is insane. It is insane. I was quadding at the compound. Like, I was clearing stuff that the 450, the stock 450, couldn't clear. And yeah, it was crazy. Whoa, we overjumped that a little bit. No problem. Yeah, it looks like we're riding on grass. This swampy mess. We're making passes. We're sitting in 12. Not too bad. Out of the way, boys. Double B is coming through. So we... Oh, I'm going to case. Case that triple a little bit. All good, though. Only in a video game, though, right? Because, I mean, you case that in real life. Your ankles, your wrists pretty painful lap two out of three sitting in uh, oh we got to shut her down that's a tight turn came out right out of that straight away there looks like we got a little step down here boom little scrub daddy wide open made our pass in the fifth right now there we go there's Jeffrey Hurlings he's the one that we would like to pass we're tied we are tied for first place overall in the championship with Jeffrey Hurlings, the man right in front of us, in second position behind Max. This is uh, second, yeah, still on the second lap. Oh, oh, it reset us. God dang it! I went out. I went off the track. That was my fault. Cut the track unintentionally. I love this track though. It flows really good. It's it's uh 
in the rain you can you can feel it in the bike it's just a little slippery not too bad though we're good we're good I love the you know we talked in the last video about this uh, the different changes in this MXGP versus the last one and one of the things that I forgot to mention but it is a huge change is the uh, the sound of the bikes the uh, the bikes the sounds in this one are so good I mean this sounds like we're riding a 250 and the two strokes as well I mean those sounds are good uh, but yeah such a huge improvement to that Man, I don't know if we're going to be able to make the pass in a first. Or hopefully we can at least steal second right here. Pass it. Max. No. Come on. There we go. Oh, I thought that was the end. We're good. We're good. Hit that inside rut. Catch up on Jeffrey Hurley's here a little bit. We come to the inside. We are nearing the finish, ladies and gentlemen. So far, we've made it happen. We're in first. This is the last lap. We just need to be consistent. Stay clean. We'll hold. try to hold the race line here and just, uh, yeah, hold them off. But we're looking pretty good now. I'm getting a little bit more familiar with the track. This is the, is this the finish line? No, not yet. Not yet. Kind of a long track, too, it seems like. We gotta be nearing the end. I should have made a note of where the finish line was before. But yeah, this track just flows so good. Jumps are good. Even though it looks like we're riding on the grass. And, and that might be a little bit of effect from the rain. Ah, uh, here's the finish line. We'll throw a little scrub. Boom! Look at that. Juicy. It's juicy. Alright, so we pick up the first place. That's 25 points. Max is in second. Jeffrey is in third, which does help us out a little bit more because we were tied from the end of round one, us and Jeffrey. Alright, moving forward. We got uh, this is gonna be the second race here of round number two. gonna go straight into this one it's kind of funny because like typically with when I'm posting to, to the YouTube channel and I'm recording I can cut out these these loading screens so <clears throat> so yeah this is this is all gonna be all gonna be on the channel thankfully we got the Xbox one X the new version and it loads everything pretty quick and so here we go. We're jumping into round number two again on the outside gate. There's the babe holding up the 15-second sign. We're ready to go racing. And for some reason, not that it matters to us because we're going to let them go ahead, but it put us far away from the gate. The game wants us to give them at least a half a bike length. All right, let's go. That's even more of a head start than we did uh, the first moto. But we won, so let's make it more of a challenge. I don't know how people play with uh, automatic transmission. I, I use, I love the fact that I can that I can adjust my gears. I use them all the time for like engine brake or for controlling the RPMs and staying in the power band. There's more control over the bike. Which sometimes does mess me up because I'll like downshift and, and I meant to not downshift or I downshift too many times or something but for the most part yeah having the manual transmission really helps a lot oh a little bottleneck here everybody a lot of a lot of riders now that rider right in front of us or two in front of us it has the red name Jens Getman that is who our sponsor wants us to pass so I think we get extra 
extra money or yeah, bonus rewards basically for beating that guy in the race. So we definitely need to get by this guy, but we're sitting in 14th position. Not bad, not bad. Still the first lap, we got plenty of time. We, we always case that triple step up, it seems like. And I love the fact that the crowd, they got their, uh, they got their smoke bombs out. I think that's a pretty cool feature to this game, too. The crowd just gets so hyped. They love it. A little scrub coming down the hill. A little pass on the inside. Kind of aggressive, but I like it. Man, it's just... Now, I think it's the rainwater that is making the track more pliable. I mean, we really got, it's just, there's ruts everywhere. And I, this is the first time I've rode this track, so I don't know if it's like this under dry conditions as well or what. But I'm liking it how it is right now. I like going outside on that turn because the inside's got a little, uh, got a little roller. Even if you scrub it, I feel like that outside there is a little faster. Yeah, look at these ruts, man. There's just lines upon lines to choose from. A good, fast outside, inside. We got options. We've got options. It is so awesome. Oh, we scrubbed the triple step up that we always case. Wasn't the smartest option, but we'll take it. We're sitting in fourth right now. This is lap number two out of three, and uh, I can't see the leader. So whoever's leading it is on one. They are moving. Out of the way, boys. Pass this KTM rider. There's Jeffrey Hurlings. So if we're in second, he's in first. Or, sorry, we are in third. So Jeffrey here is in second. So we at least want to pass him. I do see the leader now. Oh, we kind of cut the track a little bit. I thought it was going to reset us. I wanted to go way inside, but I went a little too far there. Jeffrey Hurlings is trying to pass on the inside. Now right here, you go outside, you miss that roller. I think it's a little faster. Come through this uh, smooth rhythm section there a little bit, a little whoop section. A little scrub, a little juicy scrub. There is our leader. We're catching him, but this is the last lap. We don't have a whole lot of time. Benoit. Benoit is the leader. Oh, we're off the track. No, we're not. We're back. We're back. That was actually a pretty quick line going outside to inside like that. Can we pass this dude? Oh, man. Man, it's so close. He's right there. You know what, though? That's racing. I'm glad it was a challenge. So, Benoit Paturo, he takes first. Jeffrey is in third. So, let's see how it pays out in the grand scheme of things. We made our money. We upgraded some of the skills here. Got some experience. Sweet. Even the rain ability went up. Went up two levels. Awesome. The debut season is over. Next year, we're going to see some serious action. Next season... Select new sponsor, choose an official team. Nah, we want to stay on stay on our current team. We, we like where we're at. So, all right, going into the next race. I, I'm not sure what it meant by a new season. I'm pretty sure we're in the same season here. So, no changes. We're going to go straight in. 
Los Sal. I feel like we've been here. Yeah, we're gonna have to check it out and see and and see how this is. Uh, what round this is because this should be this should be we haven't been through all the tracks obviously so I, i'm thinking this is round three unless that was like a weird preseason or something funny i don't yeah i don't think that's the case we'll see if it says anything here so we're going to la salle i don't know if i'm saying that right la salle la salle a little track preview here it's not raining anymore so we do have dry conditions and this track looks like the one that we were at for round one. So this is race one. Um, all right, let's go. Well, either way, we, there's a race to be had. We're gonna race it. Moto number one here in the 250 class. Lined up ready to, ready to rail. We need, a go we need an exhaust system on this beast. All right, we're gonna let them take off. Boom, let's go. Let this beast eat some dirt. So I'm trying to see if this, I'm, this is, I'm almost positive this is round, round one. Or, you know what? the track that we were at for round one now maybe uh in the series maybe we come back to this track now kind of like uh modern day supercross how they go to anaheim twice so maybe that's how this is i'm not sure but either way we're racing we're here we're focused on this moto passing the pack making our way up towards the front wow nobody else cleared that tabletop just double B on the stock KX250. Oh, we got connected with whoever the heck that that guy's name looked like. Scrambled letters in the alphabet. I don't know how to say it. We got connected with him. Got got toppled over. Oh, now we're running into a sign. Come on, get our bearings. Losing our bearings here. Wow, I just hit a rut. Like, I don't know what happened there. Back tire popped out of the rut. This is definitely the, re the track from round one. And we are sucking right now. We need to pick up the pace here. Be consistent. Too many mistakes. The track is like... I feel like the track is really hard packed. Like the, the way the bike's handling. It's like super unforgiving. But maybe that's just me. All right, so we're making we're making some moves, making some passes, getting past. <laughs> Sitting in 17th out of 22 riders. This is lap two out of three. I don't I don't know if a podium is gonna be uh, is gonna be doable on this one, ladies and gentlemen. I'm a little concerned about our finishing uh, status on this race. We we might be hurting. Maybe it's a good thing we didn't sign with an official team. I think they'd be disappointed with our round. Are you serious? Come on, get going. Wow, I don't even know right now. I don't even know. I feel like the bike is, it's, it's probably me, but it's uh, the, the, the terrain, it definitely feels different than our last round. The bike like wants to bounce out of ruts and like hook in some of these turns, it feels like. I don't know if it looks that way. That's what it feels like. I'm, I'm like right there, right there. I just hooked in that rut so hard. Man, it's so disappointing. We were doing okay. Well, no, we weren't. We were doing really bad. But we were starting to make some passes and come back a little bit, but not anymore. Man, struggle bus. Ah, oh, those guys are having problems too. You see that? All right. Hopefully we can get a little groove this last lap. We are lap three out of three. This is it. 
Oh, we dang near lose it again in the wolves. I don't know. This is something something about this uh, this race, man. We are we are sucking. No hope. Oh, we just overshot that like super hard, but that's okay. Thank thank you for the Cowie bringing us a good stock suspension at least. So we're making a couple passes here. I'm just riding aggressive. Kind of like nothing to lose kind of riding right here. We're in 13th, so every pass that we can make is gonna count for some sort of points at least. That's the corner that keeps getting us. It's got a little hook or something in it. That wasn't too bad. Oh, wow. I mean, considering all of the mistakes in that race, finishing 11th, uh, I will take it, I guess. Wow, you know what? Jeffrey Hurlings finished 6th, and he's usually a, a, a podium finisher, top 3 as well. So, a couple problems are Thomas Covington, the other American rider, he finished 3rd. So, that's that's good. But yeah, that was a rough one. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what happened there. I was not smooth at all. Super inconsistent. Crashed. Ran into signs. <laughs> I, you know what? We didn't go home in a helicopter. So there's always that. You know, we're the the silver lining, if you will. We're we're here, ready to race moto number two. So with that being said, we're jumping straight in. Here we are on the gate, stacked gate. We are looking for a better performance than the last round, or the last moto. Maybe the game knows we're gonna struggle. They have us up against the gate this time. But we're still gonna give them a head start. Boom, right there, let's go. I'm at least familiar with the track now. That first moto, um, like I recognize the track. God, my lord, dude. I don't even know. Ah, struggles. The struggles continue. And that was just my fault. That was just not paying attention and trying to catch the pack, being way too aggressive. Jump to the inside on that guy, make a pass, that's good. We have caught the pack. All right, I think we're gonna be okay here. We gotta be consistent. I would like to get a podium finish, top three, if doable. This is the corner that's been jacking us up. Got to be careful with that corner. Oh, and then we go into the... Mo oh, my Lord. Somebody, somebody help me. We need it. I don't know. Is it this track? Is it just bad juju? There we go. Come on. Wow, we're three wide going into the inside there. <laughs> Crazy. Man, we're getting passed on the inside or, or challenged. We're getting challenged. We didn't let him get by. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We're still in it. We are still in it. Little scrub. We're back. Come on. The struggles were real, but we're up in the ninth place. Lap two out of three. We got some time. We're on the charge. We're going to be all right, I think. I don't like that turn right there. Look at that fat rut we just hit. Wow. We were third gear wide up. I didn't even let off.
There's Jeffrey Hurlings. Man, he's struggling again this round, too. Kind of hit the sign a little bit, but we're okay. All right, so we just passed Jeffrey Hurlings, which is good because we were tied. Or, no, well, we were close. We were close in points. He is a rival competitor. So we're up in the fourth position now. We're doing much better than our previous moto. So that's good. We're, so we're at least... I, I can't talk too soon, though, because if we... This track seems to have it out for us. Come on now. <laughs> We got a little sketchy there. We're okay. We're okay. Easy. You guys know. You guys know watching. We get we get sketchy sometimes. Look at that rut. I just hit it so fat. It hooks us. By no means am I complaining though. I love the fact that there are monster ruts. Absolutely love it. Look at that. It's awesome. It is awesome. Kind of hopped out of that rut a little bit. Third position. This is the corner that kills us sometimes. But not this time. And then sometimes that, that sign takes us out. But not this time. We're okay. Oh, a little scrub. That was pretty fat. Ah, oh, there's the finish. All right, we know what though. We took a podium. We finished third, and we passed Jeffrey Hurlings, which was a uh, bit of a concern. So here we are. Yeah, third place finish. Jeffrey was in seventh. So both both of his motos were struggles. Thomas, the other American rider, he fell back a little bit. But this Benoit Paturel on the YZ250, he was killing it. So I think Grand Prix results. So here is the total. You know what? And I I don't know. It did it did start us on a new season because right now these are the GP results for the whole series. And it has been Noit who won both of these motos. He they have him at 50 points total. So Yeah, so I I don't know why we're in a new season. But we're here in a new season. So maybe that first season was a bit short. Let's do one more round. Let's do one more round. Oh, wait a minute. You can check the results of the GPs for both categories. Okay. Uh, next race. We're going to do one more. So this will be... So technically, this is going to be round number two then, I guess. Because for some reason, the first... What I thought the first championship series was, it, it was short. It, it was only like two rounds. So... Or it just started it over, or I don't know what the problem was. But anyways, we're going to do one more race. This, I guess, is the official round number two, for all intents and purposes. Benoit is leading the pack. He's going to be, it looks like he's going to be the new rival. Because um, so far, yeah, he's killing it. Uh, so me and, me and Jeffrey kind of fell back a little bit. So here we are. Round number two. Clear conditions again, which are nice. The dirt looks pretty good. Looks pretty fluffy. Got some cake batter to go play in. All right, all the bikes are clean, prepped, ready to rock our stock Kawasaki there on the outside. You know what? Maybe in the next video, we're gonna at least like, we're at least gonna put a new jersey and pants on. We're still wearing our, uh, our homemade jersey. And let's go. We're off. Oh, we just got an unlock professional rider. Wow, okay. So I don't really remember this track. It looks like we're in like Australia or something. Like it's kind of flat. The dirt's not overly red though. 
We have caught the pack. We're making moves. We're on one. A little scrub. I think we just pushed that guy into a sign. Rest in peace, homie. Super clear skies. They really watered the track down pretty good, though. You can see the standing water. Ooh, that turn's got some fat ruts in it already. And here's the rider, Jeremy Sewer. This is who our sponsors want us to be. A lot of flat turns, just rutted out flat turns. Like no burn whatsoever, just flat ruts. I don't mind though. <laughs> That's twice. The very start of the race and that lap, we cut that turn to the inside a little bit. Didn't mean to. I guess it works. And they don't reset us, so okay, I'll take it. Dove to the inside. Wow, that's just such a fat rut already. Too thick. I didn't have the downshift right there. I could have stayed in third. That turn is a big sweeper. I love this track already. Another big rut to the inside. There's an even fatter one on the uh, in the middle, it looked like. Sitting in fifth position. Almost died on that, that little scrub. There's a bunch of uh, like scrubbable jumps in this track too. We went way inside. That actually worked out pretty good though. Like look at it. Oh, fatness, that is awesome, I love it. Kind of messed that line up a little bit. Uh, so we're in fourth. Third and second is right here in front of us. I don't know where the leader is um, as we pass, or we're looking to pass at least. Dive to the inside, there we go. We made that stick. Out of the way, boys. Oh, that's so good, that rut. Just flowing. We're just flowing, boys. Oh, don't die. Don't die. Little mistake into the sign. We went off the track and brought her back while wheeling. Okay, we'll take it. Oh man, a little adrenaline rush there, huh? So we're in second now. We're at least on a podium finish. I have a feeling that Benoit is in first. Just a funny feeling. I don't know that for sure. We still haven't caught him enough to find out yet. This guy, whoever it is, they're on a fast pace. We're catching him, but this is the last lap. We got to give her the berries. We're not going to catch him. That's it. That's the finish right there. Look at that scrub. We got at least got to give the fans something. We can't give y'all a first place finish. Benoit taking all of them. So a little scrub. Yeah, look at that guy. What a beast. 458. Wow. All right. So this guy is is killing it we got some credits we got some experience in our skills here we're gonna jump into the final moto now i have to say i mean benoit and pretty much everybody else that we're racing against they're all on modded out bikes and everything else so we, we are on a stock we're on a stock 250 so they're on modded 250s way more power 
But that's just excuses. That's just excuses. We need to perform. We're just not performing enough. We could have beat him. Totally doable. I think the uh, the distance that we gave them was good at the start. So we're going to do that again here in moto number two. Let's do it. Man, they put us back from the gate again. <laughs> they gave him like a half a bike length advantage. Maybe that's a good sign. The game knows we're going to dominate this moto. Boom, let's go right there. Send it. We didn't take our cheater line and go inside that time. <laughs> Oh, bring her back, bring her back. Woo I didn't think we were gonna straighten out on that one. That actually worked out really good though. Out of the way, Cowie. There's Jeffrey Hurlings. He did not get a good start. What has happened to Jeffrey? This dude's usually dominating like podiums every time. But lately, these last two, last two rounds, he's been struggling. I mean, I can't talk too much. We've struggled a little bit as well, but but Jeffrey? All right, there's Jeremy Sewer with the red name. We know what that means. He's the, uh, the sponsorship rival. I'm not going to say he's like our personal rival because we all know that's Benoit taking all the first place finishes. Oh, a little scrub. Ooh, that was nasty. We took the inside, stole that one. This Jeremy kid, though, he kind of came out of nowhere. He's up in the third, it looks like. Or, yeah, third. So I'm impressed with his performance. But, but nobody takes the rival spot better than Benoit right now. So Jeremy's in third. We gotta pass him for the sponsor. Bam. We also spot pass him for points. Out of the way. Man, we had a killer line right there. Way outside to the inside. Woo, that that rut hooks. Now, who's the leader? Who wants to guess? It's Benoit. Go figure. This guy is just... He's just slaying right now. Ooh, we about lost in that rut. We saved it, though. We're okay. Little scrub. Keep her down on the ground. All right, all right. We're lap two out of three. We need to beat Benoit this round. And we're on one. I mean, let's be honest. We, we are flying. We are moving. little scrub right into the turn and set us up perfectly down shift in a second dive to the inside rut shift up into third get a good drive through these rollers we have made the pass ladies and gentlemen we're doing good we're doing good no complaints that turn tried to eat us last lap so uh better this time So, so far, so good. We got about half a lap to go. We are in first. We're giving her the berries. That rut.
rut is just so bad. It's third gear wide open. Just lean her over. Oh, that rut. <laughs> it just it just it ate the front tire. Brought us right back in. Here it is. Here it is. Your boy, Double B, taking the top spot. Benoit wasn't that far behind. Ah, oh, it's good to get back on the top spot, though. Ooh, we just ate it. We just ate it. We're going to the hospital. But not without first taking 25 points and the number one spot on the podium. That's what I'm talking about. So, the combination, we took second in the first race. And then first the second race, Benoit flip-flopped. So we're 47 points total at the end of round number two. Total uh, total points for the whole championship. Benoit is still in the lead, 97 over uh, out of seven, and then we're 77. So he's 20 points ahead of us overall. We got 3,260 credits as a reward for winning and beating our our sponsor rivalry. Got a little uh, some experience in the skills, no level ups there. The next race, what is it? What is it? We're going to Valkensward, Netherlands. Sandy ground, 1500 meter track. But that's going to be in the next video, guys. I appreciate you guys stopping by, watching the live stream. Uh, if you're not on Twitch, you're watching it from YouTube, thank you for your support and checking out the channel. Subscribe, like, comment, get involved. I love you. I appreciate it. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. All right. Peace.